Hey guys, this is Tattoo Tony, and uh, this is St. Mary's Hospital in Gary, Indiana. I've had three parts to this video. This is some footage, um, most of which I did not show yet, and um, so you're going to, also I got some photographs of the inside of the hospital operating rooms and what they looked like when they were actually uh, in use, and there are some old postcards that show the hospital as well, so you can see what the outside and the whole complex looked like. Um, currently, about, I don't know, 50% of this hospital is being used by the Gary, Indiana Police Department. And, uh, so we're going to get into that here in a second. A little bit of this footage is a recap, um, from the end of the last video that I made on this. Uh, so if you haven't seen the three hospitals from St. Mary's that I put up, I don't know, in the last couple weeks, um, then you definitely want to go back and watch those because there were some really cool visuals, uh, rooms covered in blood, <clears throat> just some crazy stuff, and they were very interesting. So this is in the basement of St. Mary's Hospital. And uh, this is one of the uh, old photographs. You can see the hospital here. That's before the addition in the back. Um, we were in all these rooms, but these are set up. We were in the surgical room with that tile floor. You can see it in one of the videos um, if you go back and watch. This you can see the building behind it. Um, that was part of an addition to the building. I thought you guys might enjoy seeing some of those photographs of what it used to look like. So here we're still in the basement. And... Uh, like I said, this is a little bit of a recap of some of the cool uh, stuff. Now, when we were first in the basement, we didn't explore the whole thing. Uh, towards the end of the video, you're going to see most of the rest of the basement, but unfortunately, my uh, camera light went out, and uh, we used Andrew's cell phone light because my cell phone was dead, too. Blessed Mary Catherine Casper room. So anyways, my cell phone was dead too, and uh, we used his light, and you can hardly see on camera. So the last very little bit of this video, I bumped up the exposure. So it's a little distorted, but you can see, you know, a little bit of what it looks like um, in the rest of the basement. So check it out. Let me know what you think. Um... There just wasn't much I could do it about it at the time. Uh, now I'll probably carry a second light. Or another battery for the light. Anyways, uh, everybody remember to hit that like button. The last video I put up, it did a little better, I noticed, right at the beginning. Uh, people were hitting the like button more. I don't want to explain the whole thing again. But it's more than just, you know, showing that you liked the video. It actually helps people find my channel and helps the videos be recommended to people. Um, YouTube's really put the herd on smaller creators. And uh, if you want me to keep making videos, I'd appreciate your help. So... Also, comment and share. You know, share the videos on Facebook or whatever social media you have, and uh, make sure and leave a comment too. So, we're going to get to some of the new stuff here in a second. Uh, there was that caution tape there. I'm not sure what kind of control that was. And uh, some of those rooms up there, those are actually, you know, just like the rooms you saw in the photographs earlier. This is a general look. I'm sure you guys that saw the video remember that stuff. Here we are going, walking over. Um, there's kind of a, I don't know, somebody knows what this is called, but it's a thing connecting the two buildings that goes in there. You can see the other building we're about to go in over there. The police station's over there, too. At one point, I kind of, like, knocked on a an old hallway in the basement that, that was bricked over and I actually figured out that that was something I didn't want to probably be doing because the other side of that wall is I believe the uh, locker room for the police department I'm 
this was a door that actually went outside. Uh, this is another way in the hospital. By the way, this hospital was founded in, I believe, 1908. And if you want to know the complete history and information, uh, you can go and watch the other three videos I've already put out. This is new footage here. Michael Jackson, Janet Jackson, and all the Jackson brothers and sisters were actually born in this hospital. Also, there was a California Angels baseball player who was shot in downtown Gary, and uh, they brought him here to this hospital, and he died. They weren't able to save him. Also, there are some people that, you, you know, if you, if you believe in paranormal. People say there's activity. I'm not sure if that stuff in the fridge is something I want to be touching or not, but it is what it is. Maybe they kept the ambulances in this uh, building. There was a pool over there, if anybody wants to swim. Um, everything in this hospital, or most of it, had, uh, you know, prices on it. And I was like, what the hell? Okay, here's the footage with the exposure turned up. It was creepy as hell. It was really dark. Stick with it, the light's coming back. It's caution tape tied all over this stuff. Dude, what would you do if you got that shit up to your face? 
Anyways, if you're watching on a big screen or a TV, you can really see a lot better. See the shit we see the shit we do for you guys. I hope you enjoy. Okay. And I appreciate you guys too. 